Wednesday, and also one fourth place finisher from these divisions who will be drawn by lot. Eric Ledford drives the five. Dale Loney is the trainer of that one. Here are the starters. Number one, Nakatani, owned by John Leahy, by Anderson Racing Incorporated, and Tom Lewandowski of Westchester and Crete, Illinois, and of Indiana, trained by Joe Anderson. Ryan Anderson is up. Two, Fox Valley Clem, owned by Joan Steinbrenner of Tampa, Florida, and Jane Johnston of Burr Ridge, Illinois, trained by Doug Hamilton. The driver is Dale Heitman. Moe's Muffler Shop, number three, owned by Stewart, by the Roger and Don Sampson Stable, by Peter Abruzzo and John Carver of Canada and of Illinois, trained by Mark Franz and Tony Morgan is up. Four is Havana, owned by Ed Teefee of Mount Sterling, trained by Donna Lee, Dean McGee in the bike. Five is Double H Bout, owned by Amy Barker Loney of West Van Leer, Kentucky, trained by Dale Loney, the driver Eric Ledford. Six, Neon Heel, owned by the Hagen Stable of Burr Ridge and by Julie Miller of Beecher, Illinois, trained by Julie Miller. Her husband, Andy, is in the bike. And seven, Tiger Mountain, owned by Rebecca Williams of Maywood and Eugene Lynn of Wind Lake, Wisconsin. Kevin Johnson trains. Brent Holland will drive. A try Here they come. Moe's Muffler Shop made a break behind the gate. The rest are off and pacing. Neon Heel, Tiger Mountain, and Fox Valley Clem all flashing early speed. Nakatani gets away fourth toward the inside. Havana comes out fifth and quickly finds a position down next toward the inside rail. Double H bout is next to last, and Moe's Muffler Shop, after that break behind the gate, is now moving up on the outside from last into the fifth spot. Tiger Mountain goes to the lead by a length and a half. He has just hit the quarter 26 and 1 for the opening quarter mile. And Neon Hill is covered up in second position now. And still, as they move down the back stretch, Moe's Muffler Shop is moving up. He was fifth a moment ago. Now he's second. And now he has got the lead. Moe's Muffler Shop takes over. Nakatani is off the rail and moving up as well. Moe's Muffler Shop by two. Nakatani is alongside of Tiger Mountain challenging for second. Neon Heel is fourth behind that duo. And then Fox Valley Clem. They got the half in 54 and one. Havana drops back a spot toward the inside as Double H Bout is flanking him as they move on to the far turn. Up front, Moe's Muffler Shop leading Nakatani by only a half length. Neon Heel is coming from 30 may have to go three deep they're at the three quarter tiger mountain finds himself pinned down toward the rail and fourth at the three quarter mile mark then double h bout who is followed by fox valley clem who's next to last then havana three quarters 123 and two nakatani gets the lead clear by two lengths now by three off the turn neon heel is second mo's muffler shop third nakatani final eighth mile a two length lead and neon heel is coming after him again on the outside Neon Heel won't quit. Nakatani is game. Havana from far back with double H bout, but it's Neon Heel. Neon Heel gets up by a length and a half. It is a three-way photo for place in 151 and 1. Double H bout was second. The four, Havana was third. And number one, Nakatani was fourth. So the result is 6-5-4-1. And that result is official. And ladies and gentlemen, for the sixth time today, let's say hello to winning driver Andy Miller, this time Neon Hill. Neon Hill is owned by Hagen Stable of Burr Ridge and Julie Miller of Beecher, Illinois. Andy's wife, Julie, also trains this Henry Let's Go gelding. The 6.5 exacta, look at that, $532.20.